Andy Hudson 9 here. In this video, I'll show you what could be causing the issue with your Whirlpool side-by-side -side refrigerator. If you have problems like the ice maker's not working, the lights inside of the refrigerator aren't illuminating, the control panel isn't working properly, there's something that can easily get overlooked. I know I would have never found this if I hadn't been checking around in the different areas of the refrigerator. I'm going to show you what this trouble area is. So if you go down to the bottom of your Whirlpool refrigerator on the freezer side and the trouble area that I am talking about, which has, I believe, an engineering flaw. These wires had to be routed somewhere as well as the water tube for the ice, ice making machine and the water dispenser. They had to route them down here, and the only way to really see this is to open your door. And when you open your freezer door, you'll see uh, wiring harnesses here. There's a plastic tube, and then another wire harness, and then your water tube actually runs behind that. So if we get kind of a close-up shot of this, you can see these wires here that come through this tube, and if any of these wires, you wanna check these to see if any of them are broken because the way that this door opens and closes, there's not a lot of slack in these wires and these are gonna be prone to breaking. And then when they break and these connections are lost, then that's where you're gonna encounter problems with your ice maker, with the control panel, even other functions of the refrigerator. And then also make sure that your water tube, which is behind these wires, isn't pinched because that could affect the amount of flow that you're getting in your water dispenser. And these wires do have different colors representing different functions of where they are routed. And so these um, would need to be uh, reconnected. And so you need to take the door off and then reconnect these wires, um, which would solve your issue. But the purpose of this video is just to point out this trouble spot and make sure to check that if you're having any issue with any functions in your refrigerator. Let me know in the comments below questions you have related to this trouble area for the Whirlpool side-by-side -side refrigerator. Anything that you have as far as tips and be sure to give this video a like so the more people will benefit from learning about this trouble spot on the Whirlpool refrigerator. And be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can get more videos like this one and I'll see you next time.